And it's time to go for a drive again. Another one of my typical travelogue videos where I go out and wander around and show you what my local area looks like. Only this time, we're going left at that corner. Usually we turn right. Heading down what they know as Old 31 Pier Marquette Highway and up onto Star Hill. Off to the left, there was an area that was planted as a big star somewhere in the 40s as a memorial to World War I veterans. Doesn't really show up now, it's all grown over. Down in here, I was hoping to find trilliums. Uh, actually, the whole thing was about going out to the orchards and finding the orchards in bloom, but they are all completely just budded but not doing anything. All the trees in town are in bloom, but nothing out in the country is. Ooh, nice smooth road. Ooh, what, what's that? Hey, truck! This is where the lug nut law applies. Anything that has more lug nuts than you do, get out of its way. And we're going to go over here and show you a little valley. We get a lot of tourists from Europe, and particularly this little valley that we're about to look at right here. When they stop and look out over this valley, every one of them, no matter where they're from, swears it looks just like home. Germany, France, wherever. Um, apparently, where I live looks like most of the rest of the world. Kind of hard to see with this camera, but eh, there it is. And then we jump back in Frank and Truckenstein and tear off down the road again. Because, you know, why not, right? Well, that was weird. I don't know why the hell that popped up, but it did. So, now we're back on the road, and you can see here and there there's a few trees in bloom, but none of the orchards. Ooh, wrap your ass in fiberglass. And we're heading along out toward the dam to have a look at that. Ooh, not that road. There it is. Nice little place out here. Um, back in 1986, the dam right over my shoulder there decided to collapse and drain the lake, that one. And that was a big old mess. Took out a big chunk of the freeway and all kinds of other fun stuff. As usual, this little area shows trilliums. Um, I'm told these are really rare and, and they don't show up in most places. This year, this hill only has white. Usually there's white, yellow, and purple here. And there's a valley outside of town that we know of as Trillium Valley, where you'll see white, purple, red, yellow, blue, and green. Um, apparently, that's insanely rare. I don't know. I don't, I'm not a botanist, but, you know. Nice little glacially cut valley here. The river runs down the center of it, but um, originally this was all cut by glaciers, so... It's real steep, despite what the camera looks like, and it's probably a couple hundred foot drop off there, so get a nice little close up of this guy. I have the wrong lens on for really super close up, so it's not super good focus, but there it is. That's a trillium. And um, apparently it's a pretty big offense to pick those guys, so we'll just leave him where he's at and go climb back in Franken Truckenstein and have a little more drive around. Apparently I set something wrong, so the little tagline pops up there. Oh, head stop and ingress. You know how it is. Look at how smooth our roads are! And there you have it. There's the lake that was created by the dam, and that's the end of it. 